This is video 3 in our 6 network packet Graysol Lab scenario. You can see we already have our clouds connected to our 3 2911 routers and these are connected with serial 000 by just dragging over our WIC 2Ts to this point. Our cloud is connected to serial 1 to router 1, serial 2 to router 2 etc. So we're just going to open up router 1 enable conf t give it the host name of fr1 frame relay 1 int 0 0 0 0 give that the no shut command encapsulation frame relay int serial 0 0 0 dot 102 point 2 point frame relay interface DLCI or DLC 102 now we name our DLCs 102 because it will go from router 1 to router 2 and also we can't name our DLC 12 as DLCs 1 to 15 are reserved for management we just give this an IP address of 160 so it's a class B dot 30 has this will be also our subnet mask as we we don't want to use unnecessary address space dot one dot one two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot two five two and that's the first interface configured we just use our up arrows and change that to 103 for our next interface same with the to 160 30 3.2 and that's our first router configured so we're just going to exit out of that do a copy run start save our configuration and now we're going to open up frame relay 2 router 2 CLI enable conf t give it the nose name of fr2 int zero 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 no shot int zero 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 encapsulation frame relay int zero 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 dot two oh one as this will carry the packets from router two to router one point to point frame relay interface now you can't just do int there you have to enter the whole word interface so no try and uh, do any abbreviations DLCI 201 IP address 160.1 
30.1.2 Just do the up arrows to gain access to our second interface. Is that to two oh three? So change the Del C. IP address will be one dot two. Sorry, two dot one, two point one. Double check your configuration before you do a copy run start. That's our second router configured. Now we're just going to go through and configure router 3. Host FR3. int zero 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 no shut brings up the interface encapsulation frame relay int zero 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 dot three oh one as this will carry the packets from router three to router one Point to point. Frame relay interface. You will see three oh one IP address. Two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot two five two. Now for the final interface, this will be three zero two for the brings the configuration up. Change the Del C and the final IP address will be two point two. 160.30.2.2 Let's do a copy run start. So our three routers configured. If we open up our serials, go to config. Now we can just enter the Delsey numbers. Now we enter the Delsey numbers so they were easily for configuration at this point so it'll be del c 102 that goes from fr1 hyphen to fr2 103 goes from FR1 to FR3. And serial 2. <coughs> that was Del C201. That took FR2 to FR1. And then 203. FR2 to FR3 
can see they're added. Serial 3, 301, FR3 to FR1. Three O two FR three to FR two. You can see they're all configured. They've got up to frame relay under the connections, and we just basically mirror what we just did there. Serial one goes from FR. One to one, so it's do a serial one FR one to FR three and a serial three goes from FR three to one, so it's one to three and three to one. Add that, and the final one. Serial 2 goes from FR2 to FR3 and Serial 3 goes from 3 to 2 so it's 2 to 3 and 3 to 2 on the final one and that should complete the figuration no need to edit save or anything you just click add and now we just close that out let me just grab some packets. You can see that's successful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Subscribe to the next video. That will be our DNS or DHCP fee server configuration. And thanks for watching.